I'm using Dior Skin Star by Christiane Dior. Makeup finish, spectacular glow, long lasting, and I've got the colour 031, which is sand. Studio makeup, spectacular brightening, weightless perfection with an SPF of 30. It's inspired by the professional illuminating techniques and expertise of its makeup artists. Dior invents Dior Skin Star, its first brightening, illuminating foundation, a weightless fluid, capable of instantly and lastingly recreating the spectacular and perfecting light of Dior Studios. Bare skin effect, natural healthy glow. Now on the website it says to apply in light touches with the fingertips on a fully cleansed and moisturised face. And it can also be applied with the Backstage Light Coverage Fluid Foundation Brush. That's okay, I used to brush for a smooth sheer finish. Or they recommend you buy their cosmetic sponge. Like the, um, the egg shaped sponge, the Beauty Blender. The complexion is instantly more luminous and visibly evener. A new generation of hollow silica beads captures and diffuses light in a correcting halo with no shine. At the same time, colour filter pigments neutralise colour imbalances to recreate the perfect light. Day after day, the complexion is clarified, purer, more dazzling. Anti-light trap skincare ingredients help reduce dark areas, pigment spots and redness. And adjusted to the subtleties of each skin tone, Dior Skin boasts a palette of custom shades to achieve a flawless complexion. Healthy glow, because the shades contain the perfect dose of warm toned pigments to further boost the intensity of the skin's radiance. I'm using number 031, which is sand. It has an SPF of 30, has the most beautiful smell. And I, on my skin, I found the coverage to be medium, perhaps even airing on the side of full coverage. Um, it dries quite quickly, so with the brush you have to work quite quickly. It's a beautiful foundation, absolutely beautiful. I love it, I love the effect. I love the slight brightening of the skin, the, um, the glow, and the colour. And it really is, it's particularly in the evening, I think, under bright lights. It's, this would look beautiful. Yeah, it's a lovely makeup. I'm very happy with it. And probably will be trying the new one, Vital Lumiere, um, shortly. Okay, thanks YouTube. Bye.